Hello, I'm Jill Marie, founder of SVH and Serenity Ministries. Today I'd like to introduce you to a new SVH process that I believe can assist each of us to easily, gracefully, and automatically help shift the collective consciousness of our world, and at the same time, masterfully release our own deep genetic formatting that has been stopping and blocking us from creating our highest ideal of an abundant, joy-filled, harmonious life. I believe that the new SVH process, God's Mirror, will light the flame of freedom for all of us and set a new foundation for the life of our dreams. So sit back for a quick listen and prepare to be wowed by this concept and the opportunity to light up your life. It's free, it's fabulous, and the Creator and your higher consciousness and soul are the implementers of every aspect of this process. So you can't get it wrong, and neither will they. Through the eyes of the Creator, we're already perfect. Everything is imperfection, even in its reflection of the illusion of less. This new SVH process taps into the illusion of collective lessness to identify deep genetic blocks that limit our acceptance of the perfection of self that is always reflected in God's mirror. So what is the SVH God's Mirror process? Well, it's an innovative energy field of radiance that the Creator activates and transmits out to the world through your aura. In addition to that, there's a transformational reformatting tool attached to this God's Mirror process that's calibrated to work to emancipate you from the illusion of separation and lessness. We come in contact with many people throughout the course of our life And before you even come into range of their physical and energy bodies, your constructive mind and master intellect knows the full scope of each person's current state of mind. So if someone's walking past you in fear about something or is feeling aggressive or is pondering a topic that's in conflict with harmony or is depressed or worried about money, the constructive mind has already factored any potential interaction scenarios that could occur between you and them well before the person was even in physical range of you. You know, it's said that everyone and everything is a mirror of the illusion of our own inadequacy. I don't prefer that analogy. I don't like it a bit. But I love the idea of spinning the concept of it by resourcing the data that the constructive mind accesses, using it as a mining expedition of our own, our own current life and genetic imprinting to identify any same or similar issues and limiting imprints in us that are reflected from limiting beliefs held by those that are passing by. Anytime that people around us have unbalanced thoughts and fears and limiting beliefs, God's mirror will activate a mining expedition within you to find any same or similar imprinted beliefs and fears in you. Limitations that are identified in your genetic and current life files are going to be instantly reformatted by the Creator using the SVH tool Quantum Level Reprogramming, offering you a way to automatically clear millions of programs and beliefs throughout the day, maybe even millions and billions of programs in one minute as you're passing through a crowd of individuals. We have reached a time of new thought within an enlightened age where we are choosing to be free of anything that is no supporting our elevation to heightened states of conscious awareness. We're choosing to release limiting formatting and beliefs that support lessness. God's mirror and quantum level reprogramming are tools that we can use to quiet the mind and to help us to hyper-focus our conscious thoughts so that we can drive creation energy exactly to the realities that are forming every moment in our life. We are choosing to create only ideal scenarios. So from the moment the Creator activates this process, when your brain is developing in the womb, your higher consciousness and soul and the Creator will utilize the data that is accessed by the constructive mind's innate scenario sorting feature. That part of the brain is collecting data related to everyone and everything that you come in contact with throughout your whole life, even while you're in the womb. So when the God's mirror process 
data is used to identify and reformat like unbalanced imprints held in your genetic and current life files. You're going to be stepping into a new playing field every moment in your childhood, in your adolescence, in your adulthood, all the way through your life. There's more. A gift of unconditional love is going to be sent to those that have provided you with that data. So when you activate God's mirror process, the Creator is going to activate a lifelong radiant stream that projects from your auric field. Now this radiant sweep of the Creator's unconditional love will begin in the womb and will continue to shine out to everything, your constructive mind resources. This divine installation of unconditional love is going to flow from the Creator into your crown chakra, filling the wholeness of you and radiating from your aura, radiating out to everything as a gift from you, from your higher consciousness, and from the Creator. As with all unconditional gift offerings, it's important to be neutral about whether the Creator's love radiance is accepted by all. But I can tell you that the sentience within everything will recognize the Creator's divine nature in the offering, and they will soak it up. It's going to help heal the world. So to activate this mastery process, God's mirror, close your eyes and imagine a movie screen floating before you. Now on that screen is the new SVH process, God's Mirror. All you need to do to activate it is just silently take a moment to ask the Creator if it is in divine alignment for the Creator to activate the parameters of this process, to switch on its transformational radiant sweep and begin your emancipation from deeply embedded beliefs held in the genetic and current life formatting. And then you'll wait for an affirmative sense or knowing when you're ready. And you know that this is absolutely what you are choosing to have be implemented, to be an instrument of the Creator's love and healing of the world and a release of all these embedded formats. Think or say the word, yes. And in that instant, the Creator will activate the mechanisms of your lifelong gift and the population of this world becomes your healing ministry. In fact, anytime you release an imbalance, your alliance and acceptance of it is also released from the collective. So this is even more of a healing than we can even imagine. You see, your emancipation lights the way for the world to claim that same freedom. So take a moment. Close your eyes. Imagine that screen. Ask the Creator if it's in divine alignment. And when you get your affirmative sense or knowing, say or think, yes. Together we can elevate the collective consciousness. Together, with God's mirror, we can heal the world. Namaste. To access other free offerings to support your personal expansion, check out the podcast and telecast section at www serenityvibrationhealing.com They're always free, they're always fabulous, and they'll always assist you to elevate to higher states of consciousness and to anchor to your heightened state of purpose and your master walk.